Ah, team of the season. So look at Thief for Ultimate Team. Oh, 717 coins. This player friend squad. I just need to view them. All right, how bad is my team? This should be good. Right, this should be brilliant. Welcome everybody. Oh, it's a friendly. Me, Martin Tyler. Nice to have you along for the ride. This game really is a chance for him to express himself. He's one of the best ball players in this league in world football, uh, so far to say. Well, here is the team sheet for the home side. Four, three, three. Oh, Nordvik. I think that's the key because those lads on the flanks, it's quite a complicated job actually because they've got to come inside, support the centre forward, and they've also got to follow yeah, the offside. The ball, so on them. It's offside, and the referee's given it. Oh no, it's Harry Kane. It's good play until they got that challenge in. Lee Dong Yok. That's out of play. Let's go. Oh, I tried to play the pass. Francis Coquelin. Here's Martial. Who? Keep the ball. 
Oh, this is bad. Yeah, I need to work on my foot team. I need some new players. Wait, how much is a silver pack? Okay, I'm going to work on that in my spare time. <laughs> So yeah, the only two foot ultimate team games I've played, I won like 10 nil. Uh, that's arena, goalkeeper arena, skill games, nope. Oh yeah, stadiums. Oh, found. Nothing important. You know what? I fancy it. I find see it. Women's International Cup. We will play as We'll play Sweden. And I'll go back, replace team. Who with France and or Norway? Oh god. Not a lot of selection then. Replace them with Norway. And Mexico with France. Yay. Right, it's three groups, so we'll just randomize, randomize, and close my eyes, randomize. Right, a women's international cup. Oh God, Sweden, USA. Right, what does my squad look like? And put that there. Right, footed, decent sprint speed. Yep. Wing, decent sprint speed. So put her there. Christ. So I've got decent speed. Right, foothead. Left footed, how fast is she? Not that fast.
yeah, I think I'm happy with that team. Alright, that's just I can only view mine. That's okay. Oh god, this could go horrendously. So, through ball, a good idea. Well, in this competition, we've reached the group stage, Alan. Match day one. Yeah, one of those where you want to get off to a good start. Yep. Of course you do. So, both sides aiming to do that. It's a delight to be able to uh, incorporate the women's game into the higher levels of, of football <laughs> and the level of skill is terrific. And Welcome to the Women's International Cup. Yeah, I think the biggest compliment you could give it is that it's getting closer and closer to the men's game in terms of the standards. And and instantly a penalty. The tackle. Oh, that is a clumsy tackle. It really is. And no oh, please tell me that I'm going to score. No. Nope. Right we missed that one. It's long. Now to Brian. Attacking now. Working away to try and find an opening. Defender to it first. It's gone out for a goal kick. So Sweden's women's team. Looking to win the opening group game. So would the USA team. Oh, thank God that's offside. There we go. She's not the fastest runner on the pitch. Oh, it's 1 0 to Sweden.
first goal, it's 1-0. Now to Brian. Tobin Heath. Giving the opposition a problem with their interpassing. Rushing it here. Moving from one side to the other. Great passage of passing play there. The ball being moved around. Not that well. Sweden get the free kick. And shoots! And that will peter out that attack. It's the goalkeeper's ball quite easily. Yeah, that was a poor shot. Into the attacking third. Oh, across the shelling. Oh. Great work from the goalkeeper. Fudge. Well, the possibilities were turning into probabilities as the move developed on that counter attack. Now they'll be reflecting on a genuine wasted chance. Shelling trying to get through. His school. Good forward play from them. Out for a throw. Good anticipation by the opposing player there to read the direction of the throw. Tobin Heath. Here's Apple Fist. Not a good challenge by the defender. Here's Sega. The cross. Sun getting pushed out. Just to slow. It's a turnover in play. And done. Building steadily here, keeping possession. Wasteful pass, unforced error, really. Apple Fist. Attacking now. Great defending there, stopping okay, this women's football is a giggle. Tackle here. Going for goal. That'll be a corner. Goal. Okay, it hasn't really been that much of a end to end contest. Across, oh, and there's the first half. So, start to the second half. It wasn't that entertaining. Well, this attack got a bit of menace to it. 
comes the challenge. It's nicely worked until that point, and it broke down. Now they've got to try and regain possession. <laughs> the reading of the by anticipating the pass. Here's school. Well, they've been uh, thwarted here. That's a sign of better things to come. Challenges for the ball. Here's Apple Fist. Here's Scoop. Looking School. good this move. It's not a very Swedish name. Of goal. Oh, offside. Oh, they thought they were in, but the flag has gone up. Klingenberg. Okay, this. Oh no. No, <laughs> oh, off the post. USA, too many chances. Okay, this doesn't really have the speed. We've had an hour gone here. Still 30 minutes left. Very good challenge. Heath. Oh, the normal game. In this part of the pitch. Okay, I think I've figured this women's football out now. Oh yeah, she's right footed. She's ah left footed. Uh, sprint speed's pretty poor though. And oh, yeah, it was the yeah keeper on. Now there's no fatigue, just quality about her. We saw it all in the course of her performance out here. Well the building steadily here. Want new players on very weak challenge. Although pulled back across. Okay, I'm going to be the one that says it. This women's football is kind of okay. I mean, at least we've had a goal. And at least shots aren't cannonballing off of things. Like cars in the car park. Oh, bad pass. Oh, poor shot. With 
Yeah, this is not the best game I've ever played. But it's far from the worst. We scored the first goal and I've never felt like either team's going to score. <laughs> Especially at USA, they've been dreadful. I didn't mean to kick it. Oh, USA lucky. Okay, that wasn't that bad. Right, let's have a look. Something felt that's what fell off. Yeah, I thought something fell off during that. Yeah, I think I came and saw and I might come back again. Oh well, let's try and win a game in Scotland now. We've played two games, they both ended in defeats. Well, that manager rating's gone down. Finish. Keep play salary growth under 25%. Not hard to do when you've got no transfer budget. Development. Within two seasons, have at least one player from the youth academy signed in the first season. Play at least 50% of the games in the next season. Okay. First, I need a youth academy. That guy will do. Right, off to Kilmarnock. Right, adjust the team. Put him on the bench. Oh, 
Well, we've got Duran. It's pretty handy. Paul worth yet. Yeah, I think that'll do us. Right. Right, getting into it. We're at Ivy Lane for Kilmarnock versus Inverness. Another Scottish Premier League game. Kilmarnock players, they are ready. Well, here is Kilmarnock. The <laughs> Although we were looking at the Inverness players there. Yeah, I don't think we're going to enjoy the game. Oh, Inverness. Trying to go on the attack early. Why couldn't King have just gone down? That would have been a penalty. Oh, thank God for that. Scoring opportunity, really. So you can't explain it away by him being a bit overexcited. That's to Gamara. Just working away to try and find an opening. This was a chance to go. Through, and it's 1 0 to Inverness. Fantastic start. Really quick off the blocks here. And they've given themselves a. Although we've seen this before. So let's not get too excited until. It's the second goal. You've got to admire the way he placed the ball into the bottom corner of the net. But the goalkeeper was in a decent position, but he was helpless to uh, stop that one going in. Ninth minute goal from number nine. Inverness looking for that first win. One one down in Aberdeen. Here's a chance to attack. 
Musa gets into the box. And that's offside. Kilmarnock trying to get back into the game. But can't. Oh, just wide. Yes, starting to just knock the ball around. Now it goes into the Out in the jeep. Well. Cross to King. Wins the free kick. Goes in Gamara's header. Yeah, this is this is going to be one of those games. Pull back, and it's two 0 You know, I have my doubts about playing in Scotland. Restarting at Let's not get too excited though, it's only Kilmarnock. And the game number one. <laughs> Yeah, roof of the net. So it's always going to go. Oh. Well, that was close. Hey, just play out the half then. It's King. This is an exercise in patience as they try to get an opening. Oh, gets into the box. Ball across. 3 0. Well, 
a wonderful achievement to get three goals in a team like this against opposition like this. Oh, that's a wonder a goal. Day. Certainly is for a special. Given them a comfortable situation here, three nil as the game gets underway, and that's half time at three nil. Right, make a couple of changes. Oh, good, he can play centre and midfield. the stamina like oh, saving for later it's going to be a double substitution really was a very one sided first half and the Team on the wrong end of that scoreline has got to show a bit of backbone now. Yeah, come and attack us. Leave yourselves wide open at the back. Looking for an opening with some good control build up. Really trying to use the full width of the pitch here to make some progress. Well read by the defender. Nope. Can get through and thank you. God, he can make a save. One or two players are warming up for the home team. We'll see who comes on. Goal news from Ross County. It's the second goal for Ross County. 54 minutes played. 2 1. Well, interesting news again from Alan McAnally. Thanks, Alan. Tried to tackle here, and he's done that. Oh. Nearly four. They're looking to make the change now as quickly as possible, the home team. And Smith, we've had an hour gone here and still 30 minutes left. Now they've got a chance in this part of the pitch. Come on, get it clear. A goal from uh, Ross County. It's the second goal for the visitors. 63 minutes played. 2-2. Two -two. Well, many thanks, Alan McAnally. Oh, He's Dundee are doing us a favour. Uh-oh. That's a straightforward piece of work for the goalkeeper. Well, that's not so much an interception as a poor pass. Yeah, I have to agree with that. That was crap. And they copied out. They've lost the ball. A quick check on the clock, and there's 20 minutes to go. Adam. Oh, look at how many Kilmarnock defenders there are. Uh, I just can't get the pass to... Oh. Oh, oh, oh. Kilmarnock lucky. It was a good effort, but his team can console themselves and they are still ahead. That was just sloppy. Henderson. Well, they're in a good position here. Kilmarnock no trying to come through. Bad cross, bad clearance. Space for the 
Henderson 4-0 on his debut and it's a substitute who scored he's uh, definitely come on to try and do that and he's made his manager very pleased they haven't switched off Alan late in the game they've got another one extended the lead oh, not letting up at all showing their ruthless side fair play to them well let's take another look at the goal He needs his shirt number changing. Adams. Boyle. Here's a challenge. Good one. On the attack here. And that's a penalty. Oh, thank God it's only a yellow card. And 5 0. Well, you wait an entire half for a goal, and two come together. That's the outcome that they wanted. Certainly the penalty taker. Well, he enjoys the responsibility. Just dinks it in. Beautifully struck penalty. Figure if you can get at least 20 goals in this league, you can stay up. Well, get into a decent position. Now. The there is successfully done. Oh no. I've seen that he's down. This could be a chance. Oh, thank God the injury signal ducked away. But a 5 0 win for Inverness. Four shots, four goals. A perfect day. Sir so is taking his ball, he's going home. <laughs> Look at Aberdeen trying to Scottish outdo us. Aberdeen four, Heart of Midlothian one, Kilmarnock nil, Inverness Caledonian Thistle five, St Johnston one, Motherwell two. Let's see what that means for the league tables. At the top of the table, we have new leaders in and Aberdeen with six training points. complete. In second, Celtic with six points. In third, Motherwell with six points. In fourth, St Johnston with six points. Bottom of the table, part of Midland. All right, just take it up to the next game. Third bottom, Ross County with two. And that would be Hamilton. Oh yeah, Hamilton and Celtic. All right, players sold. Got thirty-five thousand from from him. Nice. Right, I'm going to make this one the last one, guys, because I need to boogie in a bit. So we'll finish it off with that. Yep. Right, let's start with Premier League title defence. Manager of the month was I only won two. Ah, yeah, two, three, three, two. Wow. 
Entry of the Year. Entry of the Year, no. Ah, yeah, not yet because we haven't started the season. Right. Start all the Premier League title defence. Starts against Juventus in the Asia Elite Cup. Oh, yeah, I need to check these first. See what we've got going on. Scout, so I've got to be scouting somebody. We'll scout him and inquire. Oh, yeah, it's central midfielders, isn't it? Already have. E day, that guy. Can't see him getting many games, but yeah, we're playing on the Wednesday. Right, we get to play Juventus. Pedraza. Yep, 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 yep. Yeah, I'll stick with that for a game against Juventus. wondering how strong this Juventus team will be. Hi there everybody. We've got a preseason so the King Abdullah Sports City. Elite Cup and there are group matches. This is the first round of them. Yeah, interesting to see how these two teams match up and whether they're at the same stage of their preparations. I don't know what country we're in. That's a pretty nice looking ball. This is a pretty nice looking stadium. Could be his game today, the way he's been playing recently. Well, sometimes you talk about not being able to coach a quality, and I think his finishing ability is one such thing because uh, he just does it naturally. So here we go. Got some players coming back straight from the World Cup. If we're winning the World Cup, like Griffiths, Rose, and Eldon. That Griffiths saved the winning penalty in the World Cup final. I don't know if that's a U decent Juventus side, but they're only playing three at the back. That is dangerous. There we go, Asia Elite Cup. And, and Juventus, yeah, this is a good Juventus side. Although not as good as Alvedi. Great defending there, stopping that attack. 
Throw it across to O'Shea. Ball in. Oof. Playing a high cross to O'Shea. Who is effectively... A midget in terms of this team. Oh! Juventus test the crossbar. Pedraza heads out to the left. Here we go. Not defending well, but thank God we've got Griffiths. It's a corner for Juventus. It was an absolute star. Oh, and it's 1-0. That's a good goal. So Juventus have brought the best. Here's O'Shea. Well, the supporters here in Asia are really uh, taking to this tournament. I think they appreciate, Alan, don't they, that it is about getting the players fit. They're just pleased to have players of this calibre out on the pitch so they can actually see them in the flesh. Well, that's true. More often than not, they probably watch them on the television, so to see them in front of their own eyes, I think it's a thrill for the fans, and it's something different for the players too. And well, to keep the ball. Oh, trying to get it across to Gamara, but... You know, defenders. Oh, just rolled backwards. Guide it, but they got a free kick. Now over the bar. It's a grail issue. Finds El Capitano, who gets fouled. Ball in. Okay, time to take this match seriously. Not that seriously, though. That's a foul. That's a foul, and uh, they'll get a free kick for that. That's not good. And half time.
So looking at the half time scores everywhere else. How are Real Madrid only drawing? No, how are Napoli only drawing? Now for a corner. Pedraz were able to get it in. Gamara skies it. Oh no. Caught a deflection. Oh, forces a save. How many corners in a row can we get? Penalty. I'm going to guess for handball. Oh, straight down the middle. And it's back to 1-1. One, one. So, all level with Juventus. Oh, just puts it wide. Rovers just knocking the ball around to O'Shea. We've reached the hour mark. Half an hour to go. Spotted that well and intercepted. Well, that's gone back to the goalkeeper. Rovers just slowing the pace. Great passage of passing play there. Just a quick check on the clock, and there are twenty minutes to go. Well, let's make a few changes. Oops, don't want to play him that. For changes for Rovers. Maybe I should have changed him. And away through Liam Rose, who won the World Cup. Great defending there, stopping that attack. 
Yeah, that was sloppy. Go to the diamond. Thomas out wide. It'll be a throw. Oh my God, he's massive. Stumbled twice then. Is that for a corner? Rose's corner. And the 1 1 draw. See if it picks up the um the scouting. No, but, oh it's worth two point nine, that's alright. Think about that. Right, quick look at the Scouting on these few players. Right, they're all at six days, so that will be after that. Right, guys, I'm going to leave it here. Thank you for watching, and I'll catch you next time.